Well, hey, everybody, and welcome back to your next cast. Thank you so much for checking out another episode. My name is Titus, and I appreciate you stopping by as always. If you're brand new to the channel, I hope you leave a comment below so we can connect. And if you enjoy this content, hit that thumbs up button, that like button right down below. That's always encouraging and obviously helps out the channel and the videos. Um, if you enjoy this content enough that you want to see more, you might want to consider subscribing. Um, subscribing is free to you. It just lets you know every single time that we upload content. So today I am unbox unboxing another Bass Pro Mystery Tackle Box. I've been getting these for about two years now um, and unboxing one every single month. So let's just jump right inside of this month's box. Ooh, there's some nice stuff in this box too. Let you get a quick sneak peek at it. So I'm gonna get right into this because I want to get fishing, get to fishing before it gets too warm. Um, some of the things you can normally expect to see in the box are uh, what's inside car with the QR code. It kind of tells you everything that's inside the box, and uh, even some tips on how to use it. Um, you also have this uh, double digest booklet right here that has tips and tricks and things inside of it. And then you also get a sticker in your box as well, which if you collect stickers, it makes for a really good collection. I got a lot of stickers all over the place, um, a lot on my tackle box as well. So I'm gonna get right into what's in this box and I'm gonna start with what popped out first. And this right here is $12.99. It's a Guggen Squad Reckon. And it's a deep diving crankbait. Am I blinding you right there? I feel like I'm blinding you right there. Um, but hopefully I can put this in some light that you can see it okay. Let me actually open it. These things are always packaged so well. And uh, opening them is like, like you're gonna rip the whole thing apart trying to get it open. But I do want you to see a better look at, ouch, what it looks like. There you go. It's got some knocker in there. It's got some pretty sharp hooks in there. Pretty good size build on it but that's a nice lure. Um, and then we have another hard bait, which is a Team Arc, what is this? It's a Team Arc lipless crankbait. And this one's $7.99. Looks like that right there. I don't think I'm blinding you. Oh yeah, I'm blinding you right there, right? I think I'm getting better at this. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and take this one out too so you can see it a little bit better. I haven't been throwing much lipless. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do that today, but always good to have some lipless items in your tackle box. Also, it's got some rattle in it. But there we go. Um, and then we have some terminal tackle going on. We got a thick flipping jig by the Guggen Squad. We got two Guggen baits in here and this color is black and blue i'm blinding you right there right blinding you but there we go that's what that looks like and the price on that is 5.99 um, i think that's all the hard things that we have uh, we got a couple of pieces of terminal tackle in here as well we got some carl's bait and tackle pegs and especially if you're flipping using a bobber stop there you go I don't use these that often, but I use them sometimes. This is $2. And then we got some Eagle Claw Trocar Mag Worm Hooks, and these are nice. These are real nice. They are super sharp. Love these, three yard hook. And this right here is $7.99. And then we got a couple of soft plastics in here. We got some Exo Swim uh, 3.5 made by biospawn and you've seen me fish with these before but i like this color and the price on these is 4.99 and then lastly we got some excite baits which are 3.99 reminds me of a four inch yum dinger you're going to see me fish with that for sure i think they're going to work out here in the lake um so a really nice box for today again you usually get your money's worth um, in the box at some point i'll probably do a video on kind of what my thoughts have been you know since i've had a really good honest opportunity to see what these boxes are like given that i've gotten you know probably close to 30 of them um at this point but anyway i'm gonna get to do some fishing right now i hope you have a very good day and a very good night we'll see you next time